Working on this movie has been such a different experience for me than I've had before in the past. Uh, every project is different, but this one especially is, is unique because of all the, the characters and um, all the young people that are kind of like a team and a group and how talented these people are. You know, I feel really, I feel like I'm in really good company. I think it has been one of those projects that's kind of, it can be very hectic, but it all works, you know, and everyone is working really hard and, and has come together as a, as a team, you know. Hi. Hi. A bunch of us are getting together tonight at Peggy's. You know, the girl in the wheelchair. Mm. Her parents are out of town. She's got a heated pool and a hot tub. Get out of the cold and wet. Just come. You know, for the article. Of course. 842 Hemlock Drive. OK. Are you going to remember that? Yeah. How are you going to do that if you don't write it down? Half of eight is four, half of four is two, and, um, Socrates killed himself by drinking hemlock. So. The Greek guy? Indeed. Indeed. When I first read the script, I knew that, um, I kind of knew who I had in mind, who I wanted to be, why they sent me the script. Um, it was for the character of Lucy, and, and I feel like when I read it, she was the one that I related to the most. We have such different lives and such a different upbringing and such different experiences, but I definitely say there's a lot that um, makes us relate to one another. She's not as mature as she makes everyone think. That game to her is romantic of making everyone think that she's kind of this person, and she is in a way, but she isn't. And I kind of feel like that with my life sometimes. You know, everyone thinks that I'm something or... Um, expects me to be a certain way and I'm kind of just me and not like that but why not go along with it? Is it Angela? No. I understand. You're afraid to love again. Me too. It hurts so much. Even when it's right, it, it hurts. If we're afraid of it, it would be so sad. We would be just like everyone else. It's been really nice to work on movies again, and movies that I want to work on. You know, not, not like a huge movie that I feel like doesn't really challenge me. It feels so good, it feels like a next step, you know, yeah. into doing what I want, and being who I want to be, and challenging myself. Oh, the first time I met Jonathan was funny. It was like at a little coffee shop near my house, and I read the script probably two times, and I wanted it really bad, and I didn't know how he felt about me right away. But then we sat down and started talking, and I think he, we had like the greatest conversation, and we're ta we were just talking about the script and talking about the character, and I think he saw how, how bad I wanted it and how I thought I could really tackle it. <laughs> he makes me laugh, and he's really nice to work with, and... Um, I'm happy I got this opportunity.